Hey everyone, this is Gene with Mahalo.com, and I've got a great review for you today of the National Geographic World Atlas HD app for the iPad. Over the last century, National Geographic has created a standard of excellence that they consistently maintain and even exceed. Their cartography department has won many awards over the years for their archive of detailed maps and atlases. With the World Atlas HD app, National Geographic aims to bring their expertise to your iPad. The included maps, as well as the maps available for download, are of press-ready, high-resolution images. We're given three different choices of style, executive, political, and satellite. The world maps come preloaded, and everything else loads from the internet as you access it. If you want faster response times or to view the world without an internet connection, you can download specific maps to your iPad. A National Geographic logo at the bottom left of the screen lets you know when you're looking at a map that can be downloaded. Panning and zooming are controlled by standard pinching and swiping on the iPad, and when you zoom in for closer views, World Atlas HD contacts the online map service provided by Bing. When you make the changeover, the icon in the lower left corner reflects the new source. They've included flags and facts from all of the current nations of the world, and you can bookmark your favorite locations. They also suggest that you can add notes and images from your library to the various bookmarks, and I have successfully added notes, but when I tried to access my photos, the app crashed and I lost the bookmark entirely. Another annoyance with the bookmark system is you can only set a bookmark if you actually search for a city or if you select one of the nations from the menu. If you are curiously looking around your world and find something interesting, you cannot easily bookmark it for later retrieval. Also, there are some cities that are physically on the National Geographic map, but when you do a search, they don't come up. I actually know someone in Jelgava, Latvia, but unless they release a new version, I can't bookmark her town. All in all, this is a great looking atlas. The different versions of the maps are a nice addition, and I like that you have the same zoom functionality as we commonly find on the internet. Unfortunately, the bookmark system is bugged, and there are only small sets of factoids with each nation. A link to a fuller description and information seems like an obvious addition, but is not present here. I like the idea of tagging your own bookmarks with notes and photos, and I wish that it worked properly. With a company like National Geographic, I expect more from their products. They should capture my imagination and feed my curiosity. This app doesn't really do that beyond the first few minutes. I give the National Geographic World Atlas HD 2.5 out of 5. Please be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe below, and send in your review ideas to requests at mahalo.com. Thanks for watching.